down here? Do you guys have some slots available? You lost it. <laughs> we got one slot open. You know what we're training for? Hot shots get to engage the fire directly. The SEAL Team 6 of firefighters. If you give me a chance, I won't let you down. I was very uh, interested in, in showing that you don't need to carry a gun to be a hero. Um, and, uh, you know, what firefighters do um, is, is, it is a war movie, but it's a war against Mother Nature. Um, and I just found that to be a refreshing kind of uh, angle on what, what a hero is, given all the other kind of movies that are being made these days. It felt really uh, grounded and real and um, felt important, you know, for, you know, being a father now, you know, you think about movies your kids are seeing, this felt like a story that would be something I'd like them to see someday. Sooner or later, the fire's gonna come knocking in our hometown. We've been training for over four years. We've got all our hours, all our qualifications. But until we're certified hotshots, my crew won't even be able to set foot on the line. I told you it wouldn't be easy. Because the work is so grueling, I, I asked a lot of these hotshots, what is it that you love about it? And they all basically said the same thing, which is it's the camaraderie. It's being with your team, traveling in the buggies around the country, um, being, with, you know, being with your crew and knowing they have your back. That camaraderie, that brotherhood is what draws them back every season. You want to talk about it? Or you want to do your John Wayne thing? It's not easy sharing your man with a fire. Because Josh grew up in a rural community on a ranch, um, I think even worked as a volunteer firefighter at one point in his life, and had even spent time in Prescott. Um, he instantly found, felt a, a very profound and deep connection to Eric Marsh's character. Uh, and uh, when he showed up in, uh, uh, for the film, um, he became the soup on screen and off screen. Uh, in every manner you can imagine. Um, he uh, organized uh, everything from workouts with the guys and hotshot training things to having parties at his house with all the guys, really creating, helping create that camaraderie that um, you see on screen. She's barely seen you for the past few months. I'm sorry. I think we all felt the huge pressure of carrying these guys' legacies. Um, it was the thing that kept me up the most at night before we were shooting, and I know Josh and all the guys carried that as well, which is, we're not just telling a story here, we're not just making a movie. We are creating a legacy of these guys uh, and something that their kids are gonna grow up and watch, uh, hopefully at some point, and, um, and understand who their dads were. No one could be prouder of his boys than I am of you guys.